Hello and welcome. Good luck, everybody. No spinny spinny now. <laughs> to some Phoenix. Yes, good luck. It's the K5 Championship race number two of season one. We are about to hop in here to qualifying. Um, so far in practice, I think it was ninth is where I was. <clears throat> Hot track up to 125. So, yeah, very slick track. It's slower than the officials this week so far, it seems like. And the times uh, are a couple tenths down. I'm finding that a little bit higher brake bias can help with the hot laps. But uh, don't listen to me. Listen to these guys in the fives. Because I'm uh, i not quite there, that's for sure. So, I kinda, I'm kind of i interested in what Nick's saying here. He says, hot track up to 125. I'm wondering, what was, what was it during practice? If, what I can expect to change here. I don't know if we're going to find out the information, but uh, let's get out there. <laughs> don't want to wait too long. End up missing my chance. So. We'll do session optimal. Obviously very important here. Go or go home, so. Going to be real focused here for a minute. Want to get a good run of the line as well. Slady, but okay, you keep going with it. Fastest lap for Moody, 29.0. New fastest lap for Feels Phillips, pretty slow. I'm a little scared. Uh, yes. There's no grip anymore. I think the track is much hotter. I hope it is, or else I might not make this thing. G11, that might be okay. Don't slide. Don't slide. This is not going so great, but... I think we should be okay to make the show at least. First lap was better, quote unquote. Ah, oh, Justin must not have made it. That's too bad. I'm glad he tried, though. He said he was might not even going to try because uh, he was worried about taking a spot from someone who could make it. But his entry is as valid as anyone else's, so I'm glad he showed up and gave it a go. I guess him leaving allowed someone else to get in, though. So it's maybe they'll have time to do a qualifying lap. <laughs> funny. Uh, Twelfth. Uh, see Kyle. Oh, where's Kyle? Can I tell from race labs? No. What's the cutoff? I'm gonna have my be it. Let's see. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight. 30, 32. He's at 31 right now. He is very close. I think he's 31st at the moment. 34 make it. I think he's gonna. I think he might have made it. Oh, there's still a couple people ready to go, though, I think. They got times they can put in. I think he made it. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty two, twenty four, twenty six, twenty eight, thirty. He made it! He made it! Hooray! He made the race. This is, this is the first time Kyle's been able to make the race. He's been real close a couple times. And he was close this time too, And but he made it on the right side of the cutoff line. <laughs> That's awesome. I've been rooting for him this whole time. So we'll get to see him out there then. That's the end of the awesome. Um, 
couple spots above. Fortunately, Justin didn't make it. Uh, look how tough these, how close these times are, though. 29-1, all the way down to here. 29-2 makes it. All the way down here, 29-2s. Like, Justin was in the 29-2s, but just barely, man. That's crazy. Feels bad to start outside front row on the heat race. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Joe didn't make it either. Oh, no. He was saying in the Gavin's Discord chat that he wasn't sure he was going to make it. Uh, Alan here. Nice lap, Andrew. He was leading a late model race for a while, a while back. And he's got speed at times. A lot oh, lower than I Shane. Did he not put a lap in? Same here. I thought my time. I thought I was going to like barely make it in or something. That's interesting. I wonder if he hit the wall or something. That easily could have happened. Wow. Okay. So I'm interested in Nick and Gavin are stuck Mrs. Right next here. To again. Daniel makes it. A couple names I haven't seen yet, I don't think. Very interesting. Trace back in 16th. It's me. You made the race. You don't want to be in the heat. The heat for the people who did not make the show. Oh, okay. I'm uh, telling that. Uh... Get on with this. The track temp is one. I'm gonna run 62%. Great bias. We need to catch up to car number zero seven. I'm not giving bad advice. David in here, yeah. It's been a while. Eight. And the race. Three. Eight, four. Be it a good one. I said good already when I said good luck, so I'm gonna say fun one. <laughs> uh so we'll go ahead and take a peek at uh the heat race going on. Sorry, there's a lot of chatting <laughs> as we wait for the, the feature to start here. As always, there's going to be uh, chapters. Green, green, green. Two minutes to go. Two minutes. On the video for you, if you want to skip through this stuff. He, uh, Kyle says he did regular arc at 60. Yeah, I'm just going to say that. A lot of it is comfort level and driving style, too. Because you can, like, jump... You can, like, set it all the way back to 57 or something. But if you're driving in hard anyway, it's not really going to do much to help your tires. And you can get yourself uh, sideways just jamming on the brakes. And, you know, I mean, theoretically, you could also put your brake bias up at, like, 68 or something. And... If you're gentle and good long run and, you know, just kind of ease on the brakes and stuff, well, you could probably get away with it, theoretically. You know, it's uh, all about that. Usually run a bit of a higher ratio to get smooth on inputs. 
That's a new fastest lap for Taylor, 29.1. Brewer has just retired. Thanks. Checkered flags out, P12. All right. Back again. So, yeah, I, I am going to move my brake bias down to probably like 62, I think. And I'm going to do 12 to 1 just because I practiced the whole time with 12 to 1. And um, I'm just going to try to remain disciplined. And I'll do like 6 to 1.5. <laughs> Push the envelope. Uh, um, it's, I'm just going to try to remain disciplined and get the car turning. And uh, drive a lot softer during the race than I would during uh, qualifying, obviously. Yeah, happy to help. Kyle, if even if I did, I mean, who knows? I, maybe I made it worse. <laughs> There's no way really to know for sure, but uh, I just uh, was kind of trying to relay what I had going on. Um, you know, what I was experiencing. I guess we'll do a little bit of warm-up here. We don't have much time, just about a minute. I did practice green flag pit stops. Hopefully, I have to use it. Because that would mean we got some green flag racing. I'm really going to focus on saving tires this race. Because it's a long one. And uh, I think it really, like I said, to Kyle, it really should matter, I think. It feels like you can get on that right front a lot if you're not careful. Go high. Hey, good luck, everyone. Good luck, Steve. Just going to keep it steady for the good first portion of the race. So we're P12. We're going to be on the outside. Not a huge deal here, as it would be on a short track or something. We've qualified very close to Nick and Gavin again. Uh, in fact, one one thousandth ahead of Nick. <laughs> That's funny. So Andrew on the pole. Congrats to him. A very nice lap. JP's very fast here. He won an official race I was in with him. He's going to be one to beat. Mitch, of course, always fast. Gavin thankfully made it. He wasn't sure if he was going to. And he's only a couple spots behind us. He's going to start right behind us, in fact. So let me make sure I actually get hit the grid. <laughs> do we got everything ready? Yes, we do. All right, let's get out there. One to go. Oh, yeah. time by, there are three additional sets of tires for this race. Session last Food lap. And good luck. You're on the outside. Gonna have this here. Three sets of tires. This isn't uh, official racing where they give you. 28 sets of tires for a 20 lap race. <laughs> Gotta actually be careful with them. And uh, that's gonna be something I'm really gonna have to focus on because I'm used to those official races where you really have to, uh, I mean, you don't have to save tires as much. You know, over time I've tried to get better about saving tires, but you know, I'm also just saving tires for, say, an ARCA race that is only however many laps long. This is longer, so. Whew, gonna really try to be easy on this thing. Hopefully I can find the right balance. Oh good, there's a fly in here ready to distract me. <laughs> For all 125 laps. Oh, about ready to go here. We're race number two. Post car is off. Time to do your job. Let's go. Green flag. Green flag. That clear, Spotter? Spotter's not saying the darn thing. A little bit of a bunch up here. That's okay. Lap one. No reason to do anything dumb.
Outside. Outside. Clear. It's rolling the bottom. Starts okay. Not really trying to get on his outside. Being very gentle with the tires. Oh, I hope we get a lot of green laps here. That would be a lot of fun and uh, would help Nick not <laughs> cancel the league. That would be great. So far, so good. Trying to be aggressive on uh, exit rather than on entry. Get on that right rear. That's the fastest lap for Phipps, 28.8. You've just done a 29.2. Ooh, Mitch getting sideways a little bit there. He holds on to it though, but that'll lose him a little bit of time. Kill his exit. Cheeto's getting a little loose out there. B12. I'm worried it might be a little bit too easy on the throttle on exit because I am just being pretty nervous. I don't want to underdrive to the point where I'm just sitting on my right front the whole race. But I don't want to be getting loose like those guys either necessarily. Oh, don't hit the wall. That was a pretend hit the wall. Because it didn't even get me a 0x. Trying my best not to turn the wheel so much. Looks like Nick and Gavin are probably saving tires more than uh, I am. Because they are back a little farther. When I glanced, they were 7 and nine tenths respectively, though I kind of had a bad corner there. Was it a bad corner or was it a, did I hit right? As in not too hard. No. Gotta make sure I'm not squeezing the wheel too tight as well because that's not going to do me much good in a long race. Take care of my car and my my hands. <laughs> Looks like Tracy behind might be ready to get around. I will not fight him obviously, not this early in the race. trying to be consistent at the moment. Getting caught a little bit. On here. Not gonna reach him though. Car is more stable now. It would seem. Just going to the outside. I will leave him around. Outside, I guess, and tried to leave him a lane. I wasn't quite ready for him to be there. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. I'm underdriving it. I don't know. Stay low. 
really not wanting to fight Gavin right now. Still there, 14th. Keep low. Outside, clear. Car outside. Gee whiz, man. You had too hard. I'm just, I'm not trying to enter that hard right now. I'm going very long run case right now. Maybe it's not working, but I don't know, maybe it will work. I'm actually going to put my brake bias back further, I think. See how it turns out. Your lap time was 29.7. We've moved backwards, but I'm not too concerned at the moment. If they continue to move away later and later into the race, then I'll start. I'll start to get worried. But right now, I feel like I'm just being very careful. Won't be smooth. Whoa, Gavin with a little wiggle there. Oh, we got someone up in the wall. Someone overdrew up the corner, maybe. Not 100% familiar with everyone's paint schemes. That one looks familiar, but I don't remember who it is. 89 up there. You've just done a 29.7. Okay, we're not so much getting past a whole bunch anymore, at least. So I'm just kind of trying to go to a pace. And the hind's entering much harder, I think. Checking the fuel. Car turned with the brakes. This guy behind wants to go, he can do so. He's about to run me over, it looks like. Kinda have to trust him not to. Looks like we can make it about halfway on fuel. That's probably what I'll aim for. I need this guy to not run me over. He's getting very close to my bumper. The lap time was at 29.8. Looking to get past Cheetos here. I'm not sure they've been having some issues. Please don't hit me from behind. Jesus, he's getting really close. Keep low. Clear high. You've just done a 30.2. Might have to get around Thomas here. I gotta set something up, but I got this guy like right on my rear end, so it's kind of hard to set up a pass. Lap time was 29.9. Well, don't need to set anything up if he's gonna overdrive. Car outside. Mm. Uh, I just got a zero action on the car beside me disappeared. Stay low. Well, that's not me. That's not me, is it? Disappearing? It's like I'm okay. Hopefully get around Cheetos. 
Chrome Cheetos. <laughs> Delicious Chrome Cheetos. We can continue forward. Kevin's getting loose on exit. That's what you want, though. You want to be on the right rear. So, it's probably pretty scary, but it's not exactly uh, a bad thing in the grand scheme of things. Alright, we are in 14th. Oh no, we had someone lose connection. I think that guy was right around us, wasn't he? Wasn't that the guy that was on my bumper? Was that the one that was beside you? Sure. Maybe he was never even getting that close to me. Maybe it was just <laughs> prediction code. You've just done a 30.0. Thinking that he was that close. Really felt like he was going to hit me in the bumper a couple times, though. That was kind of scary. Still just keeping it smooth. That lap was at 29.9. Looks like we're about the same pace as Nick and Gavin in front of us. Did someone get the wall on entry? That might have been two. Tracy. Saw some smoke. A bit loose there, we're fine. Race is still green, by the way. This is exactly what I was hoping we'd get. I think Myrtle Beach was just an anomaly, to be honest. Straight up haunted. It, uh, I don't think the races are normally going to look like that. And I hope I didn't speak too soon, but... This race is looking good so far. Though it is still early. They're kind of stacking up in front of us a little bit. That was a it's good to not just be falling off, though. I, you know, you always worry people passing you. Like, am I ever going to get them back? But uh, okay. Car feels all right. Pretty consistent, that's what I like to hear. That's what I'm going for. Wide on exit there. Kind of got lost where I was in the corner. I'm getting loose trying to make this pass on the number two. That last lap was at 30.1. Just kind of ha oh contact. Ooh. Sorry. I was just gonna say I have to let this door bang, I guess. I let this sort out a little door bit in front of us bang. before I can start doing anything too much. I think maybe setting up for a run right there. Or overdrove it, I don't know. <laughs> that lap was at thirty point three. Wow, he's getting loose. <laughs> Looks like fun, though. Starting to get some people catching up behind.
That was a 30.2. Concentrating here. We're all very close on speed, it looks like. Your last lap time was at I think my tires might be a little bit better, but I don't know how much faster I am. <laughs> Oh, Tracy, getting all kinds of sideways. Outside. I'm gonna take advantage of that. There, He's gonna get line. that sideways. Okay, Colton, the next car is Still there. Nope. <laughs> Outside, Not gonna clear. happen. Still feels pretty good. I just think I'm not very good here, to be honest. <laughs> Go ahead. I'm gonna give you the inside out until the next turn. Take the inside. So I'm thinking lap 63 to pit. Probably. Maybe 62. Maybe earlier. We'll see what guys are doing. Trying to remember to be aggressive on the throttle on exit once I get uh, most of the way through the turn so that way I can be on the right rear more. It's easy to get nervous and not be willing to be aggressive. Wonder if we'll have anyone up front falling off hard. Your last lap time was Maybe they were going hard from the start or something. Wonder if we'll see that or not. Nick and Gavin have been racing this whole race so far, <laughs> it feels like. Alex, you will take the bottom of turn one. Was at 30.2. Huh. Trying to set up a pass. He kept it kind of down low, though. Maybe or maybe not intentionally. No idea. Lap time's pretty consistent. It's time to set up a pass, I think. I can't get it done. Your lap time 
I think his tires are much worse off than mine, but I just can't get a run. He's doing what he needs to do. Breaking earlier than I want to into turn one. That's not helping either because I don't want to dive bomb. Colin, buddy, I gotta back up my entry. A lot of my right front is hurt. Yeah, I saw. Can I get a pass done? No, I just don't have talent, man. I cannot set up a pass. That was at 30.3. I'm trying so hard, I cannot get to the inside of him, man. So stuck. That lap time was thirty point three. I wish I knew how to pass people. He is just parking it on the driving line. That lap time was 30.1. Come on, come on. No. Just not any run at all. I don't know what to do. I'm being dived on. No, not happening. Sorry. <sighs> Come on, man. Is this it? Did I get a run? Oh my gosh, please. I've never needed a yellow so bad in my life. Are you serious? That's one way to create a yell. Can you get away from me? You just hit me. 
still there at the bottom. B13, you've just done a clear point zero. All flag give me hurdle hurdle beat PTSD at this point. Jesus. I know I didn't mean to do it. <laughs> I'm in the cockpit right now. So I'm just having some issues. It's, you know, just stressful. <laughs> so. They're driving now. 18 side on I just feel fine. I just got stuck for so long. Getting stuck that long is a serious thing that can affect an entire race. Like, that was, what, 30 laps? It felt like. Probably not that many. But. Trying to use the oh Nick in the wall. Trying to use the tires now because we're approaching pit window here. Looks like Nick's okay after hitting the wall a bit there. That lap was at thirty point one. Hopefully I'll be able to execute a green flag pit stop. That last lap was like I said, I did practice, however, not with tires this worn. <laughs> so, we'll see how it goes. Oh, that thing just kept turning. Got a group ahead of us. If we catch this group, I might just pit. So I'm just going to waste time trying to get around them and then to immediately pit afterward. Nick going for a pass on. Oh, that's David. Your lap time was 30.1. That one really fell off huge, except for maybe Tracy, and even he's just a couple spots back. We got our first takers for Pit Road. Coming in next time. Because it has proven very difficult to pass, even on better tires. Pitting in here. Speed limit is 45 miles. Per oh, I just passed. I must have been really slow on that entry. <laughs> Hope I didn't scare you. I didn't mean to. I didn't even mean to do that. <laughs> oh, you've got to be kidding me! I just didn't know when pit road speed started. Six seventy six seventy eight. Okay, punch 
Fuck <laughs> Ford stinks. Watch out for people on the road here. Okay. Not a good pit stop. I'm mad at myself. Mitch, I'm gonna pit this time. Take it, take it, take it. Thanks. Good battle with you, man. Hitting. Hmm. Yeah, the tires have definitely taken a toll. Oh, oh, there we go. Single fire. Close me. Close. Run road off. is closed. Yeah, that was a good run there. I was about to see it. Whatever's the 89, they gotta come past me. One lap down. Taking the wave around because our tires are fresh. What is this gonna do to the running order? Going up there, fellas. Hmm. Great run, though, to start the thing. I assume there was some issues getting onto pit road or something. I guess should have stayed out. Lead cars pitting. Hmm. I have no idea what this is going to look like. I, I was worried for a second we'd be two laps down. I think we're not. Lucky dog coming on. on the outside. Thankfully, we had just come out of the pit, so we aren't going to have a huge tire disadvantage or anything. We're just going to take our wave around and basically be on f good tires. Obviously not ideal, though. 6380 on the right. How's uh, that 6483? Pit road is now open. Go ahead and put my tires. 66. How are you right, sir, Mitch? I had a uh, 63 right front, 76 right rear. Oh, oh, we're about wow. identical, man. Huh. Hey, didn't these things just idle at 2000s? So Gavin had pretty similar tires. It didn't do me much good, no. though. I couldn't make any passes. Or at least I couldn't pass Tracy. <laughs> I'm hoping they change that, because I'm showing that I'm idling at 1742. Yeah, that's what mine is too. I don't know why it's like that. Interesting. Yeah, they changed it for some reason. Yeah, look at that. 1742. Weird. Half about 12. So we get the wave around. Is that correct? It looks that way. That was a good 50 lap green run there. That was pretty good. What was the caution? Somebody get loose getting on pit road? Uh, I wouldn't like it yet. Yeah, well, I'll put off a third bar and call fire track smoke. Hmm. Yeah, not That's the easiest pit road. Pit road here is pretty tricky. Yeah, like what, like you just said. One to go. Next time, you'll be lining up on the inside. Pit road is closed right now. I call oh, you behind me. So I was just getting too eager there. Half the pace car. Focus. That's why. The pace car is in. Green, 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 green. Yeah. 
Was I too eager, or was everyone else under eager? Think Nick. Oh my. Never mind. I was gonna say I think Nick maybe. Maybe right before they even got to the finish line. I don't know what that was. I don't know what. Oh no, Kyle was in it. Nah, don't let this start. We had a good lap. We had a good green run going. Wonder what happened with the wave around cars. We didn't even make it back to the field. Yeah, we were, uh, we were still coming out of four when that happened. Tempted to take tires, but we have two, two limited sets to uh, do that. Pace car is 1.4 behind, so... I would like to pit here, but I don't know. Do I want to pit? I would pit just because I can't make it on fuel. First off, <laughs> didn't realize that. This car's entering one. Uh, Nick, I wanted to pit. Hey Gavin, can you tell oh, Nick that he can't right, shorten the caution? Um, I came out Andrew, right behind Andrew, right scored here. third. And I'm starting 39. We're done. Get going. I don't have any way to make him see chat, but that's weird. They want you. Oh, what happened to you, Ryan? Once you know the elite pack, before that first one, the green is coming in this lap. Seven point six. Someone text me in in the chat to. The latest green. I don't know if I'm in the right spot. I'm really confused about the whole thing. Think of a foul start, guys. Think of a foul start. Oh boy, this is messy. Thank you for saying that, because I wasn't even paying attention. No problem. We gotta catch up, guys. If there's an instant yellow on the restart, okay. you'll go to single file. Everything else is, uh, normal. Okay, Colton, be ready. We're going green for seven. About to go green. Come on, bunch up, field. Look at all this empty space. Post car is off. Time to do your job. Green, green, green. We got a bunch of lap traffic in front of us. Ultra soft and trying to make it on fuel, I think. This, because this is just a mess right now. Oh, good. We got blinking now, too. <laughs> can save that much. Fourteen, I'm gonna let you buy. Uh 
Like, I don't want to get run over from behind either. Oh, what a mess, what a mess. Bye bye. Inside. Stay high with the car on the road side. Clear. <laughs> That's pin skin. Seven point three gallons. Here. B twenty seven. I'm gonna try, I guess. Right now, it's really all I can do. There's no way I can make it through this entire field of people on, on fresh tires. I gotta try something. Seven point two gallons. Going hyper <laughs> saving here. Kind of put myself in a desperate position. That got really confusing for a minute. Seven point two gallons. Hmm. Your lap time was at thirty point four. I think this is going to work. <laughs> Having to do some weird things with my pedals here to brake and clutch at the same time and then get back on the gas real quick. It's not even changing, man. This is gonna work. It's the leader. Seven point one gallons. You've just done a thirty point two. I'm just throwing this thing away. Depends if instead of clutch I just let go of the gas and coast. Try this for a little bit. Seven point one gallons. I don't think this is helping as much as clutching did. You've just done a twenty nine point nine. I don't know what to do. I think I just overthought this race or something. Seven gallons. <laughs> Getting loose. We'll go in two miles an hour. 
that lap was a 29.9. Obviously, I can't go a lap down. Well, I guess I could if I'm saying you know, that doesn't make sense. None of it makes sense. Seven gallons. Ethan says start, that we should be able to make zero. it just fine. Why is this saying that I'm not going to make it? Seven gallons. I we need seven gallons, it says. Hmm. Stuck at seven gallons. I don't understand if we're gonna make it or not. Yeah, you have fun with your tires. I will. Seven gallons. That lap time was thirty-one. <sighs> it's like uh, my. Crew chief thing is not working right or something, because... fun finishing stick. Oh, why are they being mean to each other? This is just for fun. <laughs> I'm looking at my remaining gallons, or remaining laps. 78.2 this lab. I guess it is draining pretty fast. Yeah, my racing's calculator doesn't seem quite right, maybe. Six point nine gallons. That was a thirty point zero. Pay attention to the road, man. I feel like I'm just completely unfocused doing everything wrong right now. So indecisive on how I even want to go about this. Like, if I am trying to hyper save fuel, if I even need to. Well, that was weird. Got no track position. for you, they gotta come by or pull off. I just think you smashed okay, the wall. We're halfway home. We think about 34 minutes of fuel. Uh, uh, uh oh. Got people Yeah, then you gotta get off or you're gonna hurt a bunch of us. Come on, guys. That's a pace car, man. We're eight seconds behind. Try to be an eight turn, and I'm still bad in the field now. Well, we'll take tires and fuel. Six point eight gallons. I don't know. I I don't know if I can trust my. I guess I can't. I mean, obviously we're going to make it. There's only like 30 laps left. I don't know what's wrong with my crew chief calculator there, but it's completely wrong. The 
leader Pips is pitting. Sorry. Watch your speed limit. No worries, man. That was a pretty strong checkup. Oh we no. I got people spinning yeah, out. Got into a little bit. Hopefully no damage for either of us. Okay, I don't understand why he did that. Right here. Looks like past the box this time. That was weird. Okay. Decided to take the tires anyway. Like sometimes it, hit, it, it registers that you hit them, sometimes it just goes to you. I'm all over the place. I am just like completely unfocused, doing everything wrong. When I saw that the tires were still looking good, like not even that bad, I reconsidered and was going to just take right sides, but then it was too late. It already decided that I was taking all four. Oh. Execution has been so bad this race. I should have just stayed out with 95.95. Yeah, this thing's broken. We're making it to the end. How is 92.95? 91.95. Come on, let's finish the center green, guys. Only brought enough gear to cost them. <sighs> I'm all the way back here with no track position, and passing is difficult. So I don't know what on earth I'm going to do here. I just... I feel like I just completely messed up this race. One left to green. Line up I got it all wrong. Race the regime at the end of this lap. 91.9. He's driving off the right rear. I just gotta try to salvage something respectable at this point. Be ready. We're going green. Get ready. Trace We're is up there green. in 7th. Like, I was right around him. I could have been up there. Just fine if I didn't overthink things. The pace car is off. Be ready. Green, green, green. green. Outside, outside, clear, outside. P24. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Clear outside. There's three wide, wide. Car in front is Scott. Car outside. God, people diving in Stay hard. Low. There is a car on the high side. Stay low. Mips, just leading the race. Clear. Third place. Yeah, I just I can't get around anybody. There's nothing I can do here. Fastest lap for Meda, twenty-eight point eight. Trying to set something up, I guess. I don't know where that guy is. It's like blinking. Oh, that brought out a caution? Surprising to me. I'm still wrecking. Gavin, we survived! 
I don't know, that was very close. <laughs> 47. Carbine. I hope I gave you enough room there coming out of two. I knew that you had to come down low. <sighs> yeah, thanks for giving space to Alex and uh, Nathan. I appreciate it. Yeah, I'm really glad we got through that. That was my nice first. Yeah, David, you gave me plenty of room. That was good. Thanks. Yeah, sorry about that bomb. I was not trying to turn down at all. I'm just trying to hold my line, but it might have been that code thing, but I think thankfully it didn't affect anyone. That was real life. Fortunately, we got a couple more cautions here as we're getting closer to the end. It started very nice. Good avoidance for most of us. Pretty good. I put too much trust into my fuel calculator missiles. Fortunately, yeah, she got into that one, I think. I saw his car broken. I'm not pitting to the end. I hope other people think they need to. Because <laughs> there's no way. So I think this will be single file, maybe, because we had such a quick caution. Not sure. Maybe not, because we actually did get some laps in. Closed. Pit road is closed. P22, though. I'm just so disappointed in myself for putting myself in such a bad spot. It's because the fuel calculator lied to me. But I should have known better. Like, obviously, we were going to make it to the end. I just put too much trust into it. Line up on the outside. So the outside. Still pretty fresh tires. On the green. About to be green. Still just gonna see what I can salvage here. Okay, Colton, be ready. We're going green. Get ready, going green. As soon as we cross the finish line, Daniel, I'm gonna pull up how you get under me. Let's see right, where you car is off. Green, 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 green. Let's go. Car inside. Stay high. There's a car on the low side. Low car up high. Stay this high. Go so low. The yellow flag is out. They want you in single Okay, well, this is disappointing that it has started turning into this again. <sighs> hey guys, it's going to be a quick precaution. Just head up. Wrecked on live TV. Where are we now? I don't know what spot we're in now. Pit road's open. Twentieth. I think I prefer outside. 
starting on the outside. So I'm okay with that. They start the start finish line. Now it's going to be single file, I think. Which has not helped me. Deep road is closed. Okay, yeah, is my headset head going bad or is this, this car having a thing in the exhaust zone? No, it's no. different. Hmm. Well, I gained two spots there, but these are laps I could be using to try to race to get spots back. What are we slamming on the brakes for? <sighs> oh, man. Wesley apparently got wrecked hard enough that he has to just exit. I wonder if that was him against the wall. Single file. We're so far back now. I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna get the start and just go around me on the inside. About to go green. Stay focused. No, race panther. Yeah, I'm gonna let Daniel around once we cross the finish line because I'm not racing anybody back here. Okay, I need a job. Green, green, green. Green, green, green. All right, back green. Thank you. Trying to get everything I can. The car in front is just done up. Still there. Oh. Clear outside. So mad at myself. Oh, jeez. Go high, 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 go Sorry, David, I mean, didn't mean to get the back to there. I Should be double file again. We got some laps in. Hey, man, it happened. I don't think I have any damage, so we're A-OK. -okay. Sounds like David got robbed. Yeah, I took a zero. I was hoping you did the same thing. I thought, you know, I probably saw it before you because I was up, at, you know, in front of you. I just, I saw the guy spinning, and so I just started slowing down right away, and I was just trying to not get into him. But, yep, we're good. Gonna be on the outside unless people pit or something. Like I said, though, I'm not doing that. I don't think anybody is, though. Didn't report, and I didn't happen. 
Safety rating obviously doesn't matter in this race, though. Uh, unfortunate. It's like I slowed down for the wreck, and then I went right to just pass yeah, it, pass it all, and it didn't hit the bottom. Hmm. No sixteenth. Got the lucky dog. Let them pass on the end. Still moving forward, I guess. I'm coming around. Let the noisy one car bike. Seems like out the outside is where you want to be if you're going to be making passes. You just, they just get too much of a run off the corners. Feels like. So we're going to have 10 to go once we cross the line here. Maybe we'll get a shortened caution. Pit road is closed. Great job. 10 to go. I just don't have much to say. I'm just so disappointed in myself for putting myself back here. Got Nick in seventh, Tracy in fifth. That's those are the guys I was running around. Should be double file. Guess I'm glad I'm gonna be on the outside since apparently that's where you wanna be. file for sure okay look how much closer we are now with double file it's such a big difference You see the leader too. Okay, Colton, be ready. Didn't really do that green. before. About to go green. Stay focused. <laughs> Couldn't see you very well. Hey, Ken. P15. Inside. Oh no, what's going on? Are you kidding me? You're in the middle, three wide. Clear inside, two wide. You're in the middle, three wide. Clear, two wide. Still there at the bottom. Yeah, just don't break for X. Why would you ever do that? Still there, hold your line. Stay high. 18. There, hold your line. I don't know what's happening in this race anymore. Clear inside. Car's really loose for some reason. <sighs> I lost like six spots because I was breaking for the guy that was crashing. Gain some back, but oh, 
why is this car terrible right now? Like, why is it so loose on exit? I don't know, man. Five left to go. Your last lap time was at 29.1. Car in front lap time is at 28.9. Brake bias back forward since we're not trying to save tires anymore. Oh. Six almost in the wall there. Sorry, I'm not having to fight off that bad. Car outside. Clear outside if you want to. Car outside. Still there. Clear high. Car outside. Clear outside. <laughs> Behind someone again. Fifteenth place. Outside. White flag. One more left to go. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Outside, clear. 14th, white flag. Car outside. That lap was at Watching them crash ahead. Nearly crashing myself. Keep low. Stay low. Go in, Andrew, good race. Good race, that's crazy. That's more pressure than I've had to deal with. Good race, Bob. Terrible. That's 14th. Right. <sighs> Appreciate it, Pickle Park. I'm so mad at myself. Too bad we get had to get all stupid on the last two corners. Yeah, and the race really devolved there at the end, unfortunately. Hopefully Nick can find people that are doing stupid things. Good. Alright, guys. <sighs> Good racing, Mitch. That was a fun battle between you and me there. Did someone say something to me? I don't know. <sighs> I'm sorry, I'm just so upset with myself right now. You're right, Brad. That's it, man. I can't help. <sighs> I'm going to check out the incidents. Going on with the replay. Should be loading. There it goes. So we should be going pretty fast here through the first part of the race since. Ooh, didn't get the wall good there. Since we didn't have any cautions for the most part. Just some wall hits, it looks like.
Oh, what happened here? I forgot this happened. Yeah, I, I, I can't really blame Kyle for that one. I don't know what this guy's doing. I don't know what Cheeto's doing. what he's doing up there but I mean everyone's going except for him so kind of hard to blame that on Kyle I mean obviously Kyle can't kind of came up but also what are you doing here I think they were in fourth gear or something I don't know sucks that that happened The wall there. Oh, oh my gosh, Wallace really took himself out that time. Wow. He just got loose and it just like went all the way up the track. Oh man, what a hit. That stinks. We had some like uh, usually fast guys that finished pretty far back there. Oh, what happened there in the incidents? So that was some, uh, looked like they almost went up past their pit stop and they had to kind of like hit the brakes pretty hard. They tangled a bit. Oh. A little bit of a self-spin there. Oh, he kind of keeps it going, though, without uh, damaging the car. That wasn't too bad. Mm. So we had three wide there. 47 goes up the track just a tiny bit, but I mean, that's just tough because, you know, it's three wide. Chris Gosh was only on the to me, but I didn't clean because half his guy was still on the hot track. Lap 63. Um, let's see what he's talking about. My next lab there. Hmm, yeah. Yeah, that's what it kind of looks like. It looks like, you know, Kyle's back here thinking, like, okay, he's going to the apron. Like, he's going to be able to stick it down there. And then he's like, okay, I can take my normal line then. But then the 35 kind of, like, was not able to stick it down there. Yeah.
the caution really uh, <laughs> made everything crazy. So where were we? We're like over here, ish. Kyle, saw that. Saw the pit road incident. Saw that self spin. And then this incident. Ooh, and then, oh no. It looked like he had it, and then not so much anymore. I think his tires were really hot from sliding like that. Probably just trying to get on it and just no grip anymore, and then. Wow, nosedive into the wall. That was a hard hit. Dang, that stinks. Another guy that's usually real fast. Probably could have finished real well here, but got into trouble. Hmm. I guess I can't see it feel too bad. About 14th. I know I could have done better, but... I mean, like, this is the group I was running with right here. Right around, like, 7th where I finished last race, and I just, I completely... I just was stupid and completely messed up the strategy and I don't know. Ouch. That was a heavy hit too. In real life that one would hurt that would hurt a lot <laughs> because that's the driver's side door. Hmm. I was like, was it maybe slid up a little bit there? It's hard to say. It's like guys, it's like uh Hmm. It's like Ryan was kind of trying to be where he was. Wesley coming up. That's a racing deal to me. Like people like to throw that around, but honestly, I think that's just confusion about where they were both going to be on the track. Because we're kind of getting near the exit, so maybe it's about time guys are going up. Maybe Wesley a little bit early on it, but like early on sliding up the track, but. Stinks. Blink right there. Uh oh, what we got going on here? Sliding and then hot tires. Oh, and then we got a pile up. Whoa, that was a cool trick the 45 did though. <laughs> So they're sliding, trying to get it slowed down. 85 kind of needs to hold his brakes, I think. Is there anything he could have done about it? I mean, he probably could have kept it down lower. Hard to say, though, but, I mean, you see his tires. Like, he should be on the brakes right now. You see the tires are moving. Well, he can't. It's hard to see, but he just lets it roll. And then more people get put into it because of that. It's easy to forget when you're in the moment. But maybe that would have been less bad if they just got on the brakes a little bit more. Like, hold the brakes right now. And you don't come up across the track. So lots of people caught up in that one. Yeah, that didn't need to happen. I don't think. That was me. <laughs> Slight, just barely making it through. I knew I had to go, go, go. I said it even while it was happening. Because I knew there was a chance people could bounce off and end up over here. So. Lots of people taken out in that one. Or at least got damage. Lots of messes at the end here. Uh, again, it's that same spot. It's like the same thing again. I, like the 20 maybe could be higher up the track, but maybe the number two can be lower on the track too. It's so hard to say. Everyone's racing hard and real close at this point in the race. And then here's where I lose like 3,000 spots, it felt, it felt like. I probably lost like one. But I see the guy crashing, it looked like, and so I hit the brakes. There's one spot, two spot, three on the inside. I think I might be able to hold him off, though. So that's two spots I lost there. 
anticipating a crash. Because I see the guy go up in the wall there, and then it's hard to see. There's so many cars in front of me. I'm thinking they're crashing right here. But I got this guy in front of me. I obviously can't just fly past. Ugh. I'll lose a couple spots. Oh, man. Nick grabbed the wall. He was heading for a top five. Does he still end up getting it? I don't remember. He still gets a top five. We almost threw it away, though. He managed to get it off the wall. I guess he fought off. Let's get that spot. Oh. When he ate a little at the bottom, I think JP kind of just turned down on him, though. Late in the race, he trying to get all you can. Oh, that's frustrating, though. He loses a couple spots on the last lap. Mm. And then they're uh, pseudo three wide, not actual three wide, like... Guy in the bottom's not getting the call, I don't think. Maybe he is. I think the guy on the top's not getting the call. So he doesn't know to leave room. I just... Someone's not getting the call. I think... Yeah, I think the 86 needed to leave more room up top. There. Probably didn't even know they were three wide, though. Then we got more mess. There. And that was behind us, so no free spots from that, but that stinks that the race had to end that way. Car is flipping. <laughs> John, he is going to finish the race backward. Tracy takes that match. I guess he's just joking? Or is he actually mad? Did something happen? Maybe earlier in the race? I don't know. I'm not seeing anything. Probably just messing with him, I guess. Not an actual retaliation or anything. So, getting back to where we were. I don't know if I saw that. 86 getting in the wall. That's what caused uh, them to be three wide in the first place. I didn't realize I was right in front of it. Guy's limping across the line. Oh, look. That one is this one actual retaliation. I think he's trying to get himself banned from coming back, I guess. Is that what he's upset about? He gets loose. It's not like he did it on purpose. And then he just does that and probably makes it to where he's not going to be able to come back. Like, I don't get that one. Maybe he didn't mean to hit him that hard. Maybe he meant to just park next to him and then, like, the 55 slowed down real fast. I don't know. I'm trying to give him every benefit of the doubt, but that's kind of a dumb thing to get banned over. Like, <laughs> it was obviously an accident. But anyway, uh, I'm, I'm not too happy with that. 14's not terrible at all top half the field and ahead of some guys that had worse troubles that were faster than me but i just feel like i could have done so much better uh i just i was stupid this race <laughs> that's pretty much it i just horrible strategy horrible planning got stuck behind people like i, I should have been doing things to get track position i don't know Lots of regrets from the series, just in terms of how I went about it. But at least I kept it 0x. Didn't crash anybody or anything. Hmm. I don't know. 
I leave the race feeling kind of disappointed, but the race itself was good until it kind of fell apart at the end and uh, had some good running in there. So that'll do it. Sorry for being kind of low energy at the end here. Just kind of disappointed in myself, but is what it is. We'll get them next week, I guess. <laughs> Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.